I've never seen an anime that starts off this badly. Shinzo, also known as Mushrambo, is an anime TV series produced by Toei. In the series, genetically altered creatures known as Enterans take over Earth and rename it in their own image called Entera. Oh, hey, what's up, Miffy? It showed on, uh, or it aired on fucking Jetix and Fox. Yeah, there you go. Despite being as forgettable as it is, a lot of people remember this show. The anime is balls to the wall insane. Some of the wildest stuff I've ever seen. Without going too deep into this, I'm not trying to read verbatim a Wikipedia article on stream. Uh, long story short, Shinzo is about a girl from the past that gets locked away in a cryogenic sleep. The world ends due to the invasion of the Interrans. Once Earth is changed from Earth to Entera, uh, 300 years later, she reawakens, and her goal, her job, her one life purpose is to get to what is known as Shinzo, or in the Japanese version, Center. Once she gets to Center, apparently, all will be revealed. This is the first episode. Let's do this. The sauce. He just looks like he looks like a Mega Man character or something. He, he has such a cool design. I really wish this show wasn't a complete blunder. There's an OVA that uh, exists online. You'll notice that throughout this show, people get killed, but do not die. They instead get turned into cards. Um, it, it reeks of, buy the toy, buy the toy. But there were no toys. There wasn't a card game. There is nothing being marketed. For some reason, they just turn into cards. It's really weird, but I actually kind of like it. So why is he hanging there? What the fuck is going on? Any questions that you could possibly have at this point will not be answered. Someone is so generously offering to help him. I'm really not sure I can do this. I'll try my best. Oh, oh. Hey, okay. Yells at her. <laughs> Damn. What? <laughs> Thanks for the help. Thanks, bye. <laughs> A human creature looks like After watching this episode of this anime, I was so blown back by how fucking awful it was that I wondered what went wrong, what happened. What they did here in the English dub is they got the first five episodes, I believe, five or six of the Japanese dub and chopped out most of every episode and then spliced the remaining bits together into a vaguely, like, followable story and that was what we got as the first episode in english it's absurd that's why we're halfway through the first episode and we've always we've already had two fights and we've been transported from a giant vertical ship to a statue of liberty and why mushra has transformed twice and uh why there's a bunch of unexplained stuff and a bunch of characters that have no names that are here doing things we were supposed to have already met them they never got introduced they're just here no one could ever tame mushra but she did a human girl there's why are we listening to the inner monologue of a, a, a nobody someone we have not been introduced to oh new setting all right we're here now totally different place just utterly different location entirely. All right, who are you? I'm an explorer. I'm also a chef, and I search for delicacies while I travel. You've got so many questions, I'm dizzy. Let me think. 
Damn, a favorite anime. That's an amazing question. God, I think I like, in, in the most recent memory, I like Uninhabited Planet Survive, I think the most. It's the only anime that I have a poster for. Can't immediately think of anything I like more. Uh, Odd Taxi was pretty good. Mob Psycho is really good, ob no, obviously. There there's the usual really good ones. But yeah, I just off the top of my head. Uh, I like Astro Boy a lot. Um, hmm. Uh, I like the Super Milk Chan show. That one's pretty good. It aired on Adult Swim. I like OVAs. A lot of OVAs. They're really, really big uh, for me. Your queen will love you when you bring her this morsel. Ugh. This thing looks weird. This, again, is still the first episode. We have transformed three times in one episode. Wow. I'm not a big anime dude, though. I don't consider myself, like, an anime fanatic, per se. Like, I, I couldn't see myself making like uh anime videos on youtube or anything i don't know why i mean i have i've seen a lot of them i i have strong feelings towards a lot of them some somewhat passionate towards them but i'm just not part of the scene you know i'm not part of the 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 conglomerate i, I don't have a like a my anime list account where i keep track of what i have and haven't watched and i don't uh keep up with what is and isn't uh popular or the seasonal stuff. Uh, I don't get into gacha games and, and stuff like that, and I don't care about waifus or anything like that, really, so... I just don't feel like I'm quite the type of person that uh, should be sharing their opinion on uh, online. There are definitely far more informed people that could be talking about anime that aren't me. I know deep down they like each other. I'm so lucky. With their help, someday I'm sure to find Shinzo. There we go. Wow, they're bickering a lot, but I know that they are good. They're gonna be good friends. All right, yeah, that's uh, that is that is Shinzo episode one. A fucking mess, an absolute disaster of an anime, and uh, five episodes crammed into a single 21-minute block for North American television on a budget TV station, Fox Kids. What a mess. What what a what a shit show. <laughs> uh, I was so enraptured by how bad that episode was that I decided to watch the OVA, watch the first episode of the Japanese version, and uh, read up on it as much as I can. And I thought it, it was a manga adaptation. Excuse me, a manga adaptation. But it wasn't. There was no manga. It was an anime first and foremost, and it was made for 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 it was made to be what we witnessed what just what was just presented to us how